Hello and welcome to my bedroom. Today I'm going to answer all the questions regarding the film course briefly but meaningfully. Let's start. So let me introduce the first question. To what extent do you understand the content of the course and the requirements of the assessments? So I think that I understand the course uh, content at the high level for now. Uh, but of course, when I came to the first lesson, I was a little shocked uh, by the unknown terms, but it gave me some motivation to study. Uh, I like the story of the films and the content that we're going through now. So it seems that I'm a fast learner. So it's okay for me to have such an assessment, but still I'm a little scared of them. In spite of the fact that I'm scared, I'm also very excited. I'm excited to make films with others, I'm excited to learn, study, and I'm excited to try the new roles that I can try in filmmaking. So, I really like this lesson. <laughs> so, the question number two is that what concerns do you have about the course in general? And how could your instructors help ease these concerns? I assume that I may have problems with teamwork because by the nature, I'm a loner. However, I will try to socialize more and to share with my ideas with other people more. So I think this could be a little problem, but I'll go through it. What is the third question? <laughs> Well, the third question is that what impressions do you have of the DP film course from the early classes and the diagnostic test? I said before, um, I was scared, I was shocked that I knew just a little about making films, but the test was good since I wrote everything that we studied in a notebook and now can confidently talk with my friends about the parts of making films all, or the terms and etc. What one thing do your instructors need to know about you in terms of filmmaking or film analysis? Well, to this question, I can answer with the fact that I will always try to get to the bottom, both in making films or film analysis. Therefore, sometimes I can really overthink. <laughs> Next question. What content knowledge and skills have you already identified as necessary to succeed in this course? Well, I think a filmmaker should be some kind of politician in some facts. For example, filmmakers should be a problem-solving leader because this will help in achieving the compromise and creating the films with other people. Of course, a filmmaker should be creative in one of the main things that many people forgot about is the technological expertise because uh, if you're a filmmaker you should be um, a leader in all the branches of the film i think well maybe it, it is impossible but why not one of the things a filmmaker is a storyteller that's why we should Consider the fact that filmmaker should write a brilliant script and be a brilliant author. Oh, so I think that's kind of all I wanted to say and all the questions I wanted to answer. Um, thank you for the attention. I'm really stupid in this video because um, I'm talking about strange things and also I'm looking at the screen while I should be looking in the camera. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just a beginner and um, actually before the film course I was shooting the films about the people and I never shoot myself. And now I'm realizing that it's very hard to be <laughs> a video blogger. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, bye. See you later. Thanks for attention.
all the good for you.